A sharp jump in coronavirus cases in Italy has prompted authorities to cancel the final days of carnival in Venice. Several towns in northern Italy have also been put on lockdown, after two people are reported to have died from the disease. South Korea is also on high alert following a sharp jump in coronavirus cases there, with the total number reaching more than 600. The virus has now spread from China to more than 25 countries. Welcome to the Atlantis Report Backup Channel. Italian authorities announced on Sunday that events related to the famous Venice Carnival would be stopped as the country reported three fatalities from the COVID-19 virus in 48 hours. An official from the Lombardy region announced on Sunday afternoon that a third person had died from the novel coronavirus in the country making Italy the first European member state to have a national die from COVID-19. Authorities had revealed on Saturday that 75-year-old woman from Lombardy had died, which followed the death of man, 78, from Veneto. The country has reported 132 cases of the disease including 89 people in Lombardy, 25 in Veneto, 9 in Emilia-Romagna and 6 in Piemont, the head of the country's civil protection service, Angelo Borelli, said on Sunday afternoon. The announcement came after at least 10 towns in the north of the country were put on lockdown following a cluster of COVID-19 cases. Many of the new cases represented the first infections in Italy acquired through secondary contagion. Some of the cases came at the same hospital in Codogno, one of the Lombardy towns now on lockdown. A 38-year-old man was hospitalized there and his wife and a friend have also contracted it. Five medical staff, including nurses and doctors, have also tested positive. The sudden increase in the number of cases prompted authorities to suspend events related to the famous Venice Carnival. Veneto Regional Governor Luca Zea said the carnival shutdown would begin on Sunday evening. The event, which draws tens of thousands of visitors annually, was scheduled to end on Tuesday. Cluster of cases Italian Health Minister Roberto Speranza said Italy is now seeing the same sort of cluster of cases that Germany and France have seen. The Italian Health Ministry ordered anyone who came into direct contact with the three to be quarantined for 14 days. About 150 people, including medical personnel, were in isolation undergoing tests. Veneto Regional President Zaya said that the contagion showed that the virus is transmitted like any flu and that trying to pinpoint a single source for the cases or to establish a link to China no longer were effective containment measures. You can get it from anyone, he told reporters. We can expect to have cases of patients who had no contact with suspected carriers. While the virus isn't particularly lethal, it can be for the elderly or people with existing conditions, he said. Towns in lockdown The mayor of Codogno issued a decree ordering the closure of all restaurants, coffee bars, schools and public gathering spots such as discos and gyms. The health ministry advised area residents to stay home as a precaution. Local officials in another town, Casalpasterlengo, ordered local schools closed through Tuesday. A third town, Castiglione Dada, said its libraries, public offices, gyms and garbage depots would be closed as a health precaution. The Codogno hospital closed its emergency room, and staff were seen wearing masks as movers brought in new beds and furniture as the quarantine got underway. Deputy Health Minister Pier Paolo Soleri said the manager who traveled to China and was put in isolation is not patient zero. Lab results showed the man did not develop antibodies against the virus. Rome's infectious disease hospital is currently caring for three other people who were infected, including a Chinese couple from hard-hit Wuhan and an Italian who is now testing persistently negative for the virus after two weeks of antiviral treatment. Despite the calls for safeguards, Italians were having a hard time finding protective face masks. A sampling of Milan pharmacies reported selling out weeks ago, as did a pharmacist in Codogno. Local Italian media said on Saturday that at least 10 towns were effectively locked down, Casalpasterlengo, Codogno, Castiglione Dada, Fombio, Malio, Somalia, Bertonico, Terranova dei Passerini, Casteljurundo and San Fiorano. Individual cities outside the area covered by the ordinance, such as Cremona, issued their own restrictions after confirming there were local cases. Prime Minister Giuseppe Conte held an emergency cabinet meeting with the civil protection on Saturday. Conte declared the mandatory isolation of all people who were in contact with those who tested positive for the coronavirus and said the government was examining further measures to contain the outbreak. 
More evacuees returned to France British authorities also announced on Sunday that four new people had been diagnosed with the virus, bringing the total of number of cases in the UK to 13. The virus was passed on in the Diamond Princess cruise ship and the patients are being transferred from Aero Park to specialist NHS infection centers, Public Health England said in a statement. Meanwhile, a new plane repatriating 28 French people and 36 other EU citizens left Wuhan, China, on Friday, a diplomatic source confirmed to AFP. The French evacuees will stay in quarantine in Calvados in Normandy. This was the third plane sent from Paris to Wuhan, which has been under strict quarantine measures preventing travel for about a month. This was the Atlantis Report. Please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you.